Hello, I'm Zanzi. It's a gossip girl. If you're new here, please subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell. So, I'm Zanzi. Liema has decided to stay in a Big Brother house and compete for the 2 million rand. So, yesterday, Big Brother posted this on social media just to let the fan bases know that Liema had just lost her grandmother. And also, it wasn't a pleasant day for Liema. So, um, you know, housemates just went around the business. So, they just, you know, consoled her for an hour or two. And then after that, everyone was just doing his their own thing especially jerid with else you know but i'm not going to get into that um so mcjunior and liema were chilling in the kitchen around Woma, two three o'clock in the morning i remember i was just done with my prayers so it has become a thing for liema and mcjunior to always stay up when everyone is asleep you know so they were in a kitchen and they were having a conversation and then Mac Jr. asked Liema, why are you not sleeping? And then Liema, she was like, no, you know what? I'm restless. I cannot sleep. I really do not know why. And then Mac Jr. said to Liema, you need to sleep and get some energy so that you can win 5,000 rand for tomorrow or today on Friday for the Friday Arena game. So Liema was like, nah. Me, I'm not interested. I'll be winning the 2 million rand. She also then said to like, my junior that okay. I'll be taking from the 2 million rand, I'll be taking 50,000 rand and pay for my lawyer and then mcjuna kept on you know pushing and pushing it's like why do you need to pay for it and then liema was like nope then i was like okay liema now understands the game that it needs to be um less talk more action she is aware of the game she understands it she already knows that she is the winner in the way that she is moving in the house. I was like, this girl is smart. You know, that is the reason why I liked her. Like, first week and second week. And then third week, I just changed my mind. You know? First week and second week, we could feel Liam's present. You know, she was present. You know, she was playing the game. So forward, fast forward, she also said this was a confirmation to me knowing that Liema knows for a fact that she's taken the two minutes. And she also said that um to, to make Juna in the kitchen. That... Um, I'll be also paying for your therapist after I win the 2 million rand. And then McGinn was like, what do you need to pay uh, my therapist for? He was like, yeah, you have a lot of burdens around you. But I really don't want to go with it because it's just going to take too much of this video. So while they were having a conversation, McGinn spoke about how he grew up. You know, he grew up with just his sister and the mother being a single parent. So the mother had to go to work and he left there most of the time. So McGinn, by the age of 10 years, when he comes back from school, he needs to make lunch for himself, for the sister. He needs to cook. You know, he needs to make sure uniform is intact and homeworks and all of that. So he has resentment towards his mother. So for that, Liema was like, you know what? You still have unresolved issues. And when I win the 2 million rand, I'll be taking some of that money and I will pay for your therapist. Just like what Mpoa Badimu did. When Mpoa Badimu, um, when Mpoa Badimu won the 2 million rand, she took some of her money and paid for... Who's the, oh, I forgot that guy, guys. I just remember the face and installed some braces for him. She paid... um um the the dentist you know so yeah so liama had decided there and then that she's not going home to bury her grandmother she's going to stay in the house and compete for the two million rain that that uh, that was like you know a confirmation to me you know and then she was sleeping on the couch and then Lerato was up with papa ghost i remember and then they called her up to come and sleep in one of the extra beds go sent in so far and fast forward today's friday as well you know the husbands are not doing anything except for cleaning and they're just waiting for friday arena games big brother called Liema to the dairy room you know it's dairy sessions and Liema said that she has decided to stay in the big brother house and compete for the two million rand and she is doing this for her grandmother and the family so she has chosen to remain in the house as a tribute stating i am doing this for them and for my grandmother hashtag big brother Mzansi. 
Anyway, I'm Sansi. Till I see you again, I hope Liam's fan base it do not disappoint her because she believes in herself. She believes that she could win the 2 million rand. And at this rate, the way Jareed and the other two side chicks are playing, they they might as well just give Liam others 2 million rand because I really do not see how them playing so evil for lack of a better word people would just sit and watch them because it is so hurtful they're playing a very hurtful game you know it is very hurtful we would enjoy watching you hurt another person i was not liam's fan but at this point i'm second guessing my my choices i might as well just give liama apart from her grandmother i just don't like what jared is doing i mean liama just lost her grandmother and you are up here kissing else and also they had a conversation in the bathroom you know talking about else was busy pressurizing jerid saying that um we need to come out i want to do it publicly what liema is adjusting to the fact that her grandmother passed away can't you just have some sympathy or some Ubuntu inside of you? Instead, when you want to be like Mpumi 2.0, you want to go, you want to be seen with, with Jared cuddling and all of that. All for what? For a strategy? Well, it's not a nice thing to watch. Honestly, that is just my opinion. I'm getting very emotional about this because it's not nice to watch, Mzanzi. Honestly, it's not nice to watch. Hence, I really do not like... um reporting about liema because i feel that she's going through a lot of emotional turmoils in the house